this zetter, they were saying, a couple of boys were saying the weight of zetters is heavy. Zetters is out in and then out tractor pulls we go to, you know. Uh -huh. they, uh, they do do well. Aye. Uh, is that solely because of weight or is it the engine? Is it the... I don't know whether it's weight and length maybe too. Okay. But uh, maybe the weight's in the right place on them. What's the key? You're the tractor puller. What is the key taking off the line? Oh. Getting going. Yeah, Aye, yeah, but yeah, like, yeah, is yeah, it like, up. put her in the hat, give her the beans straight away from the start? Or is it? No, this is totally different. A manual clutch is like a car. Once you let your clutch out, you go. Yes. This is all electric. Right. Once you let your clutch out, you're sort of go on. Yes. Get yes. Go, go on. Yes. You can't yes. do anything. With I you. can't do nothing until she actually picks the bike. It is what it is, and she we can't make any changes. Oh, here. We can make changes. Oh, no. What are you doing? Sharpening up my clutch, but okay. it is sharp as it is. <laughs> can't go anymore. Yeah, can't go anymore. Computer says no. Plus five. Yes. <laughs> That's amazing. Confident enough then? Oh, here. I, John couldn't have paired me to a better ball. Like, you know, I'd, I'd will be fierce tight. I'd will be, and a super fella he is. A real sound fella. That's a good thing to go there too. But they say the adrenaline and they say like when you're on the lane, you are just clean focused to get to the top of that hill, to be first and hit them barrels as hard as you can. It used to be when you're a tractor pawn, you're sitting ready for the green flag, you know, to go yeah. tractor pawn. And you're sitting in your leg or something yeah. going like, and now looking for we're at it as well, yeah. you know, green light, go. What age are you when you done your first tractor pawn? I was up in front, front now with, a, with a, an 8170. Up in front now. I don't know, I ain't got the driver's line, but I don't know, 18, 18, 20, so only added it. And was your dad on the tractor phone? Oh, I all big time. He used to watch it. He was stony over in England. Right. He would have he would have sat and watched the tractor phone. Awesome. They would have. If you want oh, a few ones has that maybe managed the wrong way there. I don't say nothing for I could end up the wrong way too now. Right. You know what? It's turned out not to be so bad. At least the whole thing's going for sure. Unbelievable. You know what? The Listen, the, the investment, Alwyn, is uh, frightening. I would say. It's frightening. Uh, but yet, when you're down here on the day, and listen, the rain, ca rain's been raining for six weeks. You know yourself, contract them. Uh, you know, six weeks flat. You know. Six weeks is right, hey. Up next, we have Massey 6485 and a new haul TM 165, the whole way from England. 480 miles, then by his homie, they um, drove that tractor to get here. He was telling me earlier on, he never got the chance to give her a wee screw before he got going here. And away they go. New Hall's going right to here at the minute versus the Massey. Massey seems to have the age a little bit. That little bit of three ton, the extra weight starting to make the difference. The New Holland just seemed to taper off here just a small bit. She's gripping well, but she's just not that speedy. He's inside now, the steering wheel wrapped around his hand. <laughs> oh, the New Holland's falling badly behind. Oh no, Massey has it at the minute. Massey's at the top. He's the whip out, he's the whip out. <laughs> Up into the first, cut, into the first box. That's it. John McKay and the Massey out of the first box. Making his tear around, the TM still trying to get the climb to the top of the hill. Into the second box for the Massey, 6485. That's it, out the box, out the gap for the 6485. The TM is just struggling away here. Give that man and the TM a bit of encouragement here, that man come the whole way from England. Give him a bit of a cheer there, folks. A bit of a round of applause. That uh, man's after travelling a long way. And we'll just take that barrel down for the crack of it. <laughs> and that's up across the lane. Up next is Josh Jimenez, Massey, 7716. And Neil Young, New Hall TM155, the old classic TM155. Will the TM make up for the last TM? Maybe this lad had a 13 mil spanner and a screwdriver. She could be round up, Jimmy. And we're away. TM this time, making a better pace. Oh, he's going well. Seems to have it at the minute now. The mass is just not crawling away. Better eco to the TM155. Gripping well. 
This TM is a bit more bulk than the last one. I think the 155 has a, the front a wee bit there at the minute. Them farm flex flags shaking in the breeze there. Climbing the top of the hill mass, he seems to gain a bit of ground. This is getting tight here now, the TM's just after sneaking it. That's some big chips in the 155. And round he goes to the first box. I forgot to tell him, Jimmy, if you turn on the side lights, the wee flashers in the back of the red rock work. Oh, do they? There you go. Just remember to turn them on for me, run. <laughs> Up out of the second box. Yes, the TM is going to do it again. Straight run to finish. Yeah, I think the TM got that again. Well, there you go. I was starting to panic. I thought the TMs was just going to lose to the Masseys all the time. The TMs, Jimmy, we've got three or four shots to get a TM through to the final. But you're, you don't have a tracker, do you? we've got a classic matchup, Kev. No tractor, son. And you're in the tractor <laughs> VIP, but. <laughs> yeah, no response. <laughs> well, you got response no, all. Lethal. Lethal. They're fake ones, they're not. There's no yellow response. We're away. And he's smoking out his TM. TM's way down. That's had a wee screw to that mountain black wing. John Deere man, I can see the determination. He's inching the McBrown here. It's not going that well. 155 seems to have it. That left hand side seems to be just that bit slower. Slower to get going. Maybe on the lower revs, maybe for, for a bit of grip. The 155's crawling well now. I can see the determination in the new hall face. Look. Doesn't want to be showed up. That's it. And they're up to the top of the hill now. The 155 entering the first box. Everything seems to be going well for him at the minute. It's his to lose. Uh, John, there's a lit glimmer and he's going to bring it back. <laughs> it's like 9.30, he's only into the first box. The 155's making his way round to the second here. He's only just realised he's in a race, that man. <laughs> That's it. And round to the second box now for the 16.30. TM is clear. No bars knocked. Out the gap. The TM has done it. And I can tell you, one does not simply drive a new hole without the back one. They've been up them. <laughs> to let all that temperature from the back end come in and roast the back of your neck. I can never get the gas just to keep the one they open the TM yeah, or that week. One is that heavy. When am I getting the invite? Any time. Sure, I said that to you. I'm talking about the wedding. I don't know if I'm going to go ahead with it yet. <laughs> <laughs> Cut that bit out. <laughs> yeah. We have a zetter down the bottom here now. And an interesting thing about this zetter is this man was in Australia three years ago, I believe, he told me. And he seen this zetter sitting there and said, I need to have her. So he put her in a container and shipped her back to Ireland. Well, he's going to have his hands full. He's up again. Andrew Morton's 1455, if we can find him. Brand new engine fitted this week. Finished and fired up this week. That could go very, very good or very, very bad. Well, he sent me videos that he was breaking her in there, up and down hills there yesterday. So, plenty of encouragement now, lads. Reek, reek. Oh, let's hear it when they go through here. Come on. Start a Mexican wave here, man. <laughs> yeah, can, we, can we get a Mexican wave later on, you think? We'll, we'll try it the next break, lad. Down the going away. Plenty of reek out of the 1455. Oh, the Zetter sluggish to get going now. Powered by Born the Mona. <laughs> There's plenty of black reek here now. As I was saying, what environment? We don't need it anyway. <laughs> I know. There we go. There's no low emission zones around here. Andrew Martin sporting an even flow stickers, helping him along. That's at the top of the hill he goes. Brand new engine in her. Hanging on, a lock on. Make his way to first box. Give these men encouragement. Give them a shout. Big Zetter, Crystal making his way into the first box. Give a round of applause. Give him a little cheer. That's it. Martin's negotiating the bumps. Martin's sporting the wife beater for the day there, getting all the muscles out. Look at that. Give him a good old wave and a shout. Go on, you high in you. It's the roar of the Zetter coming. Family cab included in the Zetter as standard. There's Martin on his way out. The big 1455 done well, I think. Here's the big crystal. It's hard to beat the family cab, Jimmy, isn't it? Oh, hard to beat. She's like what you would call the estate of the tractor world. Did you see the small go like that? I wonder what a big Zetter would look like with a wooden kit in the back of her. Zetter, two balls down, two balls down. How have you enjoyed this year? Unbelievable. Um, 
Uh, cannot believe how the track has fared. Yeah. Um, the, uh, the wee Massey two wheel drive. Where did he find that grip? I know, unbelievable. Full grip out of thin air, you know. Fantastic up here visually, the sliding and the steering and the... I think that's what's made it. We were worried about the rain and I actually think the rain has helped it. Astonished that the work that has been put into this, you know, the marquees, the grandstands, the stage, you know, the security man and all the gates, the marshals directing you. It's colossal, and then you know I'm just I'm just skipping through the stories there. I'm 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 here, but I'm going flip me. That looks amazing, you know. It's that good, like you know. Um, oh, incredible, incredible. The spread of plant as well, you know. You have all the golden oldies, and uh, I think that's been the key because it's not they're not all you they're not all uh, new tractors. There's such a wide range. There's every single brand of tractor you can find out there. You know, there's something of it there, like which is brilliant. And how was it racing your dad again? Tell me this, how did he navigate a super tanker with no steering around those? And there's only three seconds. I was on the most nimble tractor nearly you can get, the wee short Muir Hill. And he put that super tanker around there and there's only three seconds between us. I love watching your dad and see when I get back at night and I'm backing up all the city. With cla classical music. He's, yeah, he's, he's so calm. Cool. He's so cool. calm. Cool as yeah. a cucumber. Yeah. Unbelievable. And did he enjoy it? Uh, oh, I buzz, buzz. Yes. Oh, completely, completely. And next year, we're going to see you next oh, year? Yeah. Well, they're permitting, we'll be here. <laughs> we'll be here. It's phenomenal. And did your mum come? She's she's down the bottom her right, okay. hips a bit yes, sore on us. Yes, so okay, but you see her watching. We'll have to get her a mini quad, same as Ernie next year. Uh, yes. Her and Ernie can dart yes. about the two they, quads. They can do a run. <laughs> they can do a run. <laughs> so no, as long as my tractor holds together now for the next run, I'll be happy. I'm nervous. I'm pushing 50 psi a boost uh, through through an intercooler and boots that were designed for about 15 psi plus. They're about 20 year old. So. I could be the uh, the guy that blows up this year. So. And did you have a wee bit of a wee bit of an issue before coming? What I, happened? Talk to me. Yeah, uh, it was sprung a bit of a leak uh, last second, so we were one of the ones frantically spanning late into the evening yesterday. So yeah. And what was it? Where was the leak coming oh, from? It was a wee leak on, on the fuel pump, but right, okay. uh, we got our wee gasket just dislodged a bit, so we got her. We got her sorted. Was it a replacement? Gasket job, yeah, or was yeah. it just tightening it up? Yeah, tightening it up, and it was okay. okay so okay. no, all good, all good. So. And will you have her running then? As soon as it, your class is called, will you have her running, taking over, heating up? She's warming up there now. Yeah, you want them nice, even heat right throughout the whole engine. You know, so whenever you, whenever you hammer it, you know you're getting a very concentrated heat in a very small uh, area of the engine, and it's not good for you. You know, you want a nice, even heat through the whole thing. So. Okay. Bit of fire in her belly and uh, go down and stoke it. <laughs> stoke. Yeah, throw yes. a shovel of coal in there. Yes, yes, give her a good poke <laughs> and then she's ready to go. That's what about it. the start? What's the best way to get off that line? Um, Do you give her the beans? Do you let her off easy? Do she uh, get the grip and then give her the beans? What's. I'm, I'm erring on the side of tractor pull experience. I know my rough approximate gear, probably the, the low range pack, which I'm trying to see if the high range pack, which is from. 10th gear onwards, so we'll start probably 8th to save that pack. Yes. I'll probably be full revs and just drop her. Yeah. I have a bit of a delay in the pack, which is frustrating, so I'll be trying to juggle that into... And is that a common thing, that there would be a delay in it, or is it, or is it just big blue? Is that the way? It's, it's that machine, it's electronics, it's like, it's yeah. a self-protection, it brings it in gradually instead of, you know, yeah. sat there to break stuff, yeah. you know, yeah. so we'll try and avoid that. <laughs> and who's been the best one so far? Who have you, who have you watched and you went, you know what, that was awesome. Classy. Phenomenal, you know, and you had the grip, but then you had the raw acceleration, you know, it just it left and away I went like a wild horse, you know, oh, astonishing, astonishing, so. Andrew Martin seems to begin to bit of ground now in the 1455, there's some noise of that center here, the bark of that, center's in the game this time, it's tight, nose to nose we go, that's it, give them boys a roar, come on, Take them on! Oh! It's better than that. We're doing it big time! Better got it. I enjoyed that. There's a good round of applause from the audience. We appreciate that. Right. Brilliant. I'll head on. Good I wish you all the best. Thank you. 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 Jimmy, I see Ebonite a fate 1890 at the bottom of the track. <laughs> a big fate 1890, which is versus 
Uh, 64, any hey, lad? On the pool, nemesis. <laughs> all and young. We'll try and keep the tailors on the four wheels this time. Audience, can you all just take one or two big steps back? <laughs> <laughs> I can assure you, ladies and gentlemen, Owen Young does not need any encouragement whatsoever. We're just holding for the cameras, folks. We, we have to get this one on camera. That's an important one. The last time we didn't have the GoPro going when he flipped the trailer. We're just making sure we get it right. Everybody watch them barrels this time. Oh, that's, oh no, things are not going well for the feet here. The trailer's going sideways, pulling over the ruts. The feet is taking your approach, Sean. He went out to one side. All one's gone, all one's gone. I can see determination in all one's eyes from here. He, he's even leaned forward to me. There's, there's white knuckles, he has white knuckles. He's out on here, he's going for it. He wants to win. Up the top of the hill we go, all of them. Into the first box. 189, the end of the first box. All one's exit at the first box. 189, making his way out of the first box. All one in round, that's it. Go on, give it to her! He is not a man that wants to be beat or Owen Young. That's it, round he goes. And out the gap for Owen. It looks like we're getting a Massey 1-2 in the leaderboard here. Oh dear, there's the rain. John, did you have to mention the dark cloud, did you? Oh, that's the second black cloud. I got the rid of my black cloud. Up next, we have the 3185 Fast Track and a T6 180. I don't believe the Fast Tracks are the best grippers or the best pullers. I have proven to be wrong the all time. I missed the last fast track, how did it do? The last fast track done surprisingly well. So she, did, she didn't lose by a milestone, I think. She actually won one pole and I think she lost all her. That's it, we're away now. Fast track seems to be going well, John. Going well again. I'm going to eat my words here, the fast track's going very well. Oh, he, he knows his engines, he considered changing the engine before he came, but he stuck with what he had. He's the one he bought, wasn't as exciting as he done. That's it, he's on the pull up the hill. He is pulling away there, that fast track. I'm going to have to eat my words again. A lovely nice note out of that 3185 as well. Doing well, not so shabby. Into the first box he goes. asking me about the deck weight during the week what the rules were. Uh, See, is the deck weight fitted? That's what it is. Johnny, you went long, lad. Making all the difference. The only difference is the fast track isn't as nimble on the track. Man down, man down. The steer lock just won't be renowned for being the best on the fast track. D6, 180s. Out. D6 is out without a barrel knock. Ah, out we go. A modern crystal to me, I believe, is what I see down there. Yeah. Kean Dilly, Zetter, 170, new type, and Andrew Dunlop and the Dutch, 61, 65. Two models of tractors here not widely seen in the country. A Zetter might just surprise us all. You never know. There we go, flags are down, away we go. Dude seems to have got the better takeoff. Even with that extra weight in the front, you can see the front lifting. Seems very confident this is a style of attack up the straight. All guns blazing. Just not exactly able to leave the setter far behind. Tires are lovely and clean. Ground must be starting to get into a bit of shape. Up and around the first corner to the first box for Andrew Dunlop. And in and out. Doesn't look to be any penalties there. Into the first box for the Zetter. Next big tractor, that big black dude. Yeah, it's a, it's a serious looking machine. Into the second, that's it. And out of the second box, just like that. Nice is out the gap. This is going well. And out he goes. And across the function. Nothing too shabby about the. We have a new leader, Jimmy. We have a new leader. Yes, who have we got? All one young top the pole there, 50 second, seven second lap. I think all one young is going to be hard to beat now, to be honest. 
a man that has done tractor pulling and endless competitions, like it's there, the co the competitive side. You've still got to get a clean run through the barrels, lad. You've still got to get a clean run. Sunday the 3rd of March, we got the ticket sales going live. And not only that, a bit different this year, we have Farmflix's big week end, who we're going to have at our big concert. We have some top talent for you. We've got two banging artists. One's a local boy, Colin Graham, and we've got Michaela Fredrickson coming in from England, and boy, she can sing. Are the nerves kicking in yet, Joey? I am getting nervous. You don't get nervous? Now, compared to the last tractor, what's this one sitting at? 185. And out of the two tractors, which is, what do you prefer? Which one do you prefer? Oh, this. This? No. Oh. When did she come into the fleet? Oh, about three years ago. Where'd you get her from? The oven. And was she, was she meant like this when you got her? No, she, no, she was like a dog. Oh, was she? Uh, oh, she wasn't a dog, no, she was just dull. Oh, she has been worked? Yeah. Hit them buttons there, because we lift's not working inside. Who's the man to beat in this class, Johnny? Owen Young? Aye, oh, definitely. He is some operator, like. He's power too. Aye. I'm lacking though. What's the plan of action here at the starting line? As hard as I can go. You, you just, I, I, I'm going to go down way into the lane. I'll jump out of the lane. You can feel that weight on the back like it has no Definitely no now. Just got over your gear changes? I wasn't going to do a gear change. I'm going to have to. Start of it, you'll have to. I'll not, I'll not get taken off in, in first and third year. Like. Okay. The last time I didn't curse at all, I was just watching myself. This time may be different though. No, we'll see. Right, go on your way to the lane and I jump out. That thing had a wee touch or two. Oh, that's higher than that thing. Right, good luck, Johnny. There you go, I did not know Johnny Neal had an MX-150. Johnny Neal's full of surprises, gentlemen. There you go, well, you learn something new every day. Come on, boys, what are we waiting for? An invitation? Come on. Ernie's part of that tractor pulling crowd. I wouldn't be surprised if he gives him a run for his money here. Right, these boys are waiting. Can we send them away here? He seems to have a wee bit of upper hand at the minute. Lenny Reid coming out of the mass out, must be well picking up. The MX150 seems to have the age at the minute now with Johnny Neal. He's leaned forward, he's lying the nothings are white. Johnny is coming for it. Any closer he's going to be like that one the screen. Come on, Johnny. Johnny has a full set of front wheels on. I think making all the difference there. Plenty of grip. I think MX is looking well now, to be honest. Give Johnny and Ernie a big round of applause to come up around. Give a round of applause, guys. Come on, give a round of applause. Johnny has her into the first box. There's Ernie into the first box. Round the go. <laughs> Johnny's out. Johnny's sand at her here. Look, that's it, Johnny. Give them men a round of applause. Keep at them. Go on, gee them up. Johnny's round, heading for the gap. That's it out. Johnny's away, out the gap. Ernie's round. And out the gap for Ernie. Are these a Red Rock specially manufactured tiller for here today, John, are they? Absolutely, they're very unique. They're uh, a low loader body, a tiller chassis, reinforced to carry the concrete to make sure there's zero flexing. 
24 ton running gear, uh, heavy duty special. And have we all one to thank for all this this year, do we, after the water escapade? Pretty much. The Red Rock, Red Rock boys, I left a blank canvas. <laughs> Pretty much, they came back and said, we needed that strong there, lads. <laughs> right, we're just getting the green flags lined up again for takeoff. No barrels are hit. That was good going. That was good going. See him again here. We were slower on the exit the last right. second. Um, flags are down, away we go. Big lift there from the MX. Ernie seems to have got a better takeoff this time. He is starting to gather a bit of momentum. Good bit of smoke there coming out of the 8130. Climbing the hill. I mean, tighter this time. We're a bit neck and neck coming up along here now. There's nobody really walking away with this time now. Climb, climb. Got a smoke out of the MX. Johnny's up first. Making his first turn into the first box. Everybody over on the right hand side, give Johnny a good deal of encouragement there. Everybody on the left, keep Ernie right. Pretty much, not much in it at the minute. Johnny has a little age. Johnny's out. Second box. Johnny out the gap first again. He's out the gap. Johnny has it. A good time there, I'd say. Johnny knows how to keep it to order. He's, yeah, I thought he was going to go down the field at an awful rate too. One on the right. I was breathing like a sow. Were you? <laughs> one, one barrel you hit. You did not. You did? You hit one barrel up there. On the way back out. Uh, must have been. I'd say you want to find out your time. What was what was Johnny Neal's time there? Did, Johnny, did Johnny Neal hit a barrel there on the second run? Yes, that's correct. Yes. I on the second run. With the trailer or with the tractor? Oh. Um, Jeez, I don't know where to hit it. Yeah. You alright, did I want to go where I went wrong the last time I went to the Can anybody tell me was Johnny Neal one of them four? Nope. Johnny Neal wants us to tag a video there because he didn't hit he doesn't think he had a barrel. He has headed the back window of the tractor, I didn't hit the yeah. I don't know what to say to you, Johnny, but, but you know, yeah, well, look at the first time. No, ah. no, you didn't hit it first time. I did. No, on the very first run when they made forward. Oh yes. So when I come back you, out the yes, trailer, the first run of that, you didn't hit a barrel. No, but I didn't hit it the second run either. Right. I'm telling you, sitting. He's been taking looks at me. I watched every one of them. Right. Johnny Neal's not about happy there. Said he didn't hit a barrel. Thinks he didn't hit a barrel. So, you only. What did you say, Johnny? The only way you've had a barrel is the, the trailer for the sorry the tire for the tractor and not the trailer. Is that what happened? I don't know what I'm saying. Is that the only way it could? Yeah. Only yeah. So there you go. Check a footy. See what happened. Did he hit it with a tractor? Did he hit it with a trailer? Who knows? I am in class four, so I'm heading to the pits. I'm a second pull. I would like all my fellow class four drivers to join me as we head to the gate and the marquee to find out what order we're running in. I'd swap you. I'd pull you, chap. You want me? Aye. Seriously? Aye, I'll drive. Go ahead, let me take it off. Aye, we're on the front, on. You've been serious now, don't we? Absolutely. <laughs> Genuinely. I would try C-Box, but you make it away with D. Just don't wreck my clutch, please. Okay. Jimmy's going to drive a 7810, people. He's coming out of retirement. He's going to take a 7810 up the track for me. Have we got 50k? Oh, aye, 50k if you can reach it, lad. <laughs> Here we go. Two 155s. The dad is a parent. That is the pair we all wanted to see. I think that's the two lads are set up down here. It's going to be a case of maybe which one got a touch more than the other one. There's plenty of smoke here, so I'd imagine the two of them are open out a little bit more. And we're off. We're away, we're away. Two classics, some make some photo there. But this right hand side, people, I seem to be doing some fishtail. Only the knob had a sticky spot halfway up that hell. You look like you found it further at one stage. Seems to be fairly neck and neck coming up here to Broward Hill again, lads. Sun is starting to blister out now, it's serious. 
Well, the wind dog's making the difference at the minute. It's going to be a matter of who keeps these bars standing. Right hand side tucked in. Left hand side bars clear around. Oh, ball down, man down. Oh, down. Left hand side just has to keep him standing and he has it. I think he's just about going to do it, he seems to. There you go. He's out to gap, he has the bars clear. Left hand side, I would imagine, has done it. TM. On the right hand side of the five second penalty, we're at the barrel, so this TM one. We're just swapping over all and this is our final. Is that GoPro still on all one? No, it's not. Did it, did it beep? No. That one did that. It's all wrong. <laughs> You're in the final, sir. You nearly said a bad word. I did, I did, <laughs> nearly did. So, oh, I thought that was the final. Is it? No, that's a, that was a semi, so you're, you're, you're the winner of these two here. Do I have to go again? You have to go again. Go on down then? Yep. 71 from the final, oh no, sorry, 70 from the final, isn't it? Yeah, 70 and 77 in the final, guys. 70 and 77. Roger, thank you. Right, so the pressure's on. Right, you can do it, I see it then, you all one, good luck. We're set up down the finish line here now. It's all about not bucking the barrels. We're away, lads. Plenty of smoke out of New Holland below. What do we think? Is all we're going to bring home some silverware this time to make up for last time? I think he's, he's really trying to make up for last year, John. Arr. He seems to be taking that bit of a lead there now, coming up the left-hand side. Don't forget now, he has to get a clean run, no barrels. And don't turn over a trailer. Oh, the, the minor detail of keeping her on the wheels. Here we go, they're coming into it. He's keeping that pace in, he's clearly out in front. Through the first box, no barrels knocked. He's keeping a close eye on it, the 155 is only heading in now. Oh, he's determined, he can't even see me. Oh, it's a walk-in from here, boys. Walk he's out, he's out, he's out, he's done it. We give him a cheer, lads. Give him a cheer, give him a cheer, give him a cheer. Fair play, fair play. I think he wanted that one more than anyone else, John. Oh, he definitely wanted it. He was coming, to, coming with a vengeance this year. <laughs> Should have won it this time. So who, yeah, who are you going for in this class, John? I know your own 7, 8, 10 is in it, but look. Ah, look, lads, she doesn't have the muscle. On paper, on paper, the 724 should walk this. On paper. Okay. I don't want a 724 to win. That's not what I said. Hey. All right. That's a quick drive. Aye, well, look at. I was kind of sitting up on the side of the, the side of the two tracks. I was on harder ground, maybe. I, I come up that side last time, and I think I was another bandage. I was on the high. Yeah, yeah. So, but that was uh, a good close race. I know. It was that. Uh, yeah. No, good enough. Fair play. Fair play. Oh, so I'm driving. Oh, it's close, like. Ah, oh, it was well matched. I'll tell you what, though. Uh, Zero barrels down for the both of you as well. This didn't touch anything, like so. That was a good match for a play. Like, enjoy it. Yeah. Coming back next year. Yeah. Maybe need to give her just a wee slight, just a wee slight screw the next time. Just a wee bit more. Maybe it's the driver. Maybe it's a different driver. I think you handled her really well there. Like that was some going. Like all the weights at home, thinking I'll see him with tires driving all that. I saw that. I have no weights on. Right. Right. Probably, because you seen at the start, she was trying to get grip. Ah. You lost her here, ah. trying to get a bit of grip. And I seen you going out a wee bit of the track. Ah. You're trying to find a bit of grip. I just followed the last wind tracks and I thought, look, he had a good run. I don't know ah. where he went. Ah. Ah. We give this man his silverware, will we? Oh, man, get out of the cab. He has the chest out now. Oh! Hey! <laughs> I think you were looking for that one. <laughs> oh, and young, you have redeemed yourself in style. <laughs> have you any words of wisdom for your fellow drivers? A fair play to them. They're definitely, everybody's going well here. The, um, it's nerve wracking now, definitely is. Well, all in, you have won the Deflog Shield. Congratulations. Thank you, John. The last time you wanted to take home some silverware, well, this time you have. Give him a round of applause there, Fox. Give him a good cheer. Well done. Right, we'll have a look. First up. 
in class four of Unpool 23 is a 7530 driven by J and a 6145R driven by Hugh. So a fairly too well matched for 7530 heartbeat. Just coming up to halfway point there, 7530 just, just nose in the head. And I think if he keeps them barrels up, he'll be hard beat here now with this pair up. 145 just, just sitting, just hanging, looking for a bit of traction. Into the first box. Clear through the first round in here. 614. This is uh, Hugh Barr on the left hand side here in the R series, folks. You might remember Hugh from the last time when he was the guy with the dudes. With the window open like a coal man, as Jimmy called him, the smoke flying through the cab. He was working hard, he was rebuilding the ditch, he needed an engine as well. He said he was working hard at her 11 o'clock last night trying to get her ready, but it just didn't happen. So the front line farmyard tractor is on track. But the 7530 has... She just sailed it like, didn't she really? There was no competition, yeah. We'll not call that one close. I'm sorry, you, but like... He was around boxes before you were even in him. What do you think, Shay? Your gas is as good as mine. Hey? Your gas is as good as mine. This could go either way. So don't call you the legend for now. Watch out, mate. Mightn't be much the legend after this. <laughs> we're here at this year's On the Pole 2023. What has it been like? It's been very good. From 2019, when you were here with the two Murhills, to now, how, how different is it? A lot, a lot better, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Spectator-wise, what stands out for you? I didn't really look at them that closely, <laughs> the right. but anything is classic. Ford. Yes. Big horsepower. What about that one right there? The 698, the Massey, Massey. Yeah, yeah. Very, uh, done very well for the size of it. What have you brought to the event this year? We brought a 1884 County, 141 Muir Hill, and then the son Alistair here, the 8970. Talk to me about the county. Where did she come from? It came from England. It was the south of England, and it was used on a snow plow. Right. Now the south of England doesn't get any snow, so the owner didn't no, need it anymore. No work for it. And no when, did she, when did she come into your fleet? Must have been 12, 15 years ago. Wow. Counties has a bit of a, a reputation or an aura about them. Yes. And that's the ultimate county. There was the last of the model, the biggest of the model, and there was very few of them made. There were two boys debating over what potentially she could be worth. You could be talking anywhere 200 grand. That much? And how many, how many of them are about now? Not sure, I think it's about 20, 25 in total over the whole of the UK on France and Holland and London and Holland. Would she be the prize tracker that you own? Yeah. She is the ultimate? Yeah. Amazing. And what was she at a new sport back in the day? Basically farming. In Lincolnshire, the big arable farm, right. they would have had big plows and big drills and that sort of thing behind them. I see, I noticed when you were going round the barrels. As always, you were very calm and collected, and I was speaking to Alistair about it too. That thing can't turn very well. The lock on the county is not very good, and that was one of their slight disadvantages, yeah. Yes. So how did you then tackle the track? Uh, the side brakes and defense brakes. With your right foot on the throttle and your left foot operate the two brakes. Right. So for a brake a whole run. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> if it didn't come round, you just give her a wee job. Yes. There's actually power assisted brakes on it, so it's okay. very easy. Wow. Yes. Yeah. Wow, okay, I didn't know that. Big Blue's here? Yes, he's due to go anytime a lot in 8970 beside it there, I see. Yes. But I think it's just bog standard, so it'll be interesting to see the, the comparison. The difference in them. You could operate the engine, I've just heard there the other day that you can get a, a 7.8 litre engine on that particular model. Right. Apparently, you have fitted them into the combine. So if I can find the set of pistons and just pour them out, and that's all it's really needed. That's unbelievable. Yeah. And in terms of the start, getting off the starting line, what advice would you give someone? It's 
It depends on the conditions, depends on the tractor. Yeah. If you have a lot of torque, you can let the touch up and put it and go. If you don't, you put it first and then let the yeah. touch up. <laughs> All the pull is back, baby. So the big thing you need to remember is when the tickets go on sale, which is Sunday the 3rd of March. And you can find the ticket sales on www.onthepoll.co. Farmflix website will also have a link. Just Google on the poll, you, you'll find us. Can't miss it, can't miss it. Here we go, it's all or nothing. I think C you'll have to do, D's a bit too high. Against the fate, I think 718. Very old. So we'll have to give Jimmy a bit of uh, grace on the first go round. He's never actually sat his backside, my tractor never made driven. And we, he's up against Dara in the fence 718 as well, so. Yeah, disappointing of a fifth bit this like. He's away. I think Jimmy knows Dara. I think Jimmy secretly would like to quite beat Dara. I don't know, this fence is he's starting to gain a bit of pace oh, here, John. He's back to bad lane, he's back to bad lane. That's the wet spot. Andre did not have look at the bounces from Jitter. Jimmy's going to have to trot back in the next leg. He's still neck and neck. If this man knocks a few barrels, it could be. Oh, Dara drives for 11, sir. He's not going to hit any barrels. Jimmy! Give it to her, Jimmy! What was, what was it Jimmy said to me? Come on, Jimmy, you're not out for a Sunday drive! We're pretty neck and neck coming in here. That's all oh, bar oh, gone for Jimmy. Jimmy, Jimmy keep the toe Jimmy. on her, Chief. Come on! He's going to get her stuck, John. <laughs> Trying to get a bit of traction. Ah, oh, Dara looks like he's having a walk in the park again. Still there. They're neck and neck coming up along there now. I'd like to see Jimmy just keep a toe on her and see if he can spin her through the barrels. Rip the whole place asunder. Yeah. The sod's flying, as Jimmy was saying. I want to see the sod's flying. Come on. Here we go. The fence is into the first block. Jimmy's not far behind this time. Better run out of him. Four clean through the first bend, no bars knocked. Jimmy finding it hard to get that John Deere turned. He is really struggling to get her around. Oh, oh. oh Jim, 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 oh, Jimmy. He's done it again. He's had the, he's had the side break and he's had the back wheels locked, the back wheels up. The side break is killing him. Jimmy, I forgot Not to the I forgot, side break, Jimmy. I forgot to tell you, the brakes in the come on very sharp if you touch my brake pedal. The bend is done, lads. It's going to be a hard one to beat in this class, I think. A good pilot. Jimmy! Go and hitch off that trailer and get back up here. <laughs> get back up here, will you? <sighs> what a disaster. Next up, we've got a classic matchup, Kev. We've got a T7 200 New Holland. On our 145R. I'm going for the New Holland. T7 200 all day. I think he'll sail it. They make a good engine now. They make a good engine. Uh, I think they're going to sail it. After this one, we've got a, a classic battle. Johnny Neal is on the track again with the 4755. And uh, he's against Andrew Fenton's 3690. Here we go. We're away. New Holland is out in front. I think she's going to do it. I think it'll be no issue. John Deere is over and back to track, looking for traction. Just coming up to the halfway point now, and the T7 is just a nose in front. I think 
into the first corner here. Pretty neck and neck. Deer taking the kind of slower approach. 200 just coming around there. Touching the brake, bad brakes, New Holland. So the trailer's not locking up, nice to see. Oh, he's going to have more than one down here. Oh, no. Red flag, red flag, red flag, red flag. Red flag. Oh, he's at. That was my biggest fear, that the barrel would go in and actually flip the driller. That's why I'm red flagging them. Enjoying yourselves, lads? Right, guys, I want to hear this one. I got the DJ stop there. Remember, we got a bit of sound in class four. We might as well listen to it. Rumor has it Farmer Phil's down in there somewhere. He'll be rooting for the 3690. He says he's bringing his next year. Where's the missus? At home looking after the stock. <laughs> 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 Did you not learn your lesson? Once she's married, it's like, you're staying at home and you're like, I'm away, I'm away. I'm, away. I'm staying at home, you can go. <laughs> that was it, I was like, do I come with No, 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 why would I want to look at tractors first? She's feeding, she's feeding the stock, so she's happy out. So, we've got Farmer Phil here, ready, come over for the show. How's it been for you? Brilliant. Ah, oh, brilliant. It's a bit um, mucky, but... I suppose it makes oh, more crack out there, right. slipping and sliding in here. And we were worried the class there, because we've had so much rain for six weeks, never mind last night and uh, last week. But I actually think by having so much rain and the track being the way it is, it's made it all the better. Oh, it has, yeah. I've seen that 698 tearing up the track there with Chrysler. Flying up the hill there and into the corner then just kind of let it down a bit. But. Yeah. Uh, Next year, you fancy bringing one of your yokes over? I think we might bring two. Two? Hey, damn it, right. Come on, you've heard it here first. Farmer Phil's coming next year. And he's bringing two tractors. What are you bringing? 3690 and uh, 6499. Awesome. So, I, I, I'll show him up now in the 99. So. Oh, you think so? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you might, uh, we might need to bring a 13 and just give her a wee screw. <laughs> just a wee bit of a screw. Just a wee bit of a screw. Yes. yes. Awesome. Well, I don't oh, think you can I screw a common rail, can you? No. I don't think you can screw No. Lots of power there. What's been happening lately in your life? What have you been at? Or what's... Oh, waiting for it to dry. Yes. Like yes. everyone else. Yes. So, I'm waiting for it to dry to get back at silage and slurry and we're just tipping around. 3690 is still sitting on blocks. You know, it's just waiting. And how's my life treating you? Oh, grand. It's no different than before. Right. You still in the honeymoon period? You wait another couple of months and then we'll see. You start getting the phone calls. Wow, well, where about are you? Are you coming home here and you're thinking, oh, no. No, no, that's good. That's good. That's good. Um, thanks for coming. Really appreciate it. Great to see you. And uh, next year, can't wait to see both of you with your both tractors. And you want to go head to head? There you go. Oh, oh, just so I can beat him, that's all. My first time driving this tractor. I have a son. Four years. He's the same. You oh, know yeah, they're, all they're all cocky. They're all cocky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's good to hear that gets you. You know yeah, what I mean? We're away. Flags are down. Right. Odds are the mass is coming out to get first. We're keeping an eye on him. He's going to get a clean run and get himself into semis. The deer is just keeping that little bit of pork. This time, halfway through there now, they're just neck and neck. The deer just falling behind again right at the cruise point. Massey's just going to slip in here. Hopefully, keep them barrels standing. Yeah, they got a box one safely. He's in a clean run so far. Johnny making use of the side break over here again. Coming around at the box two. And he's three without touching. Yeah, Massey's true, clean run. I tell you, that back window got very close to that trailer coming around there. Massey is true. No barriers down. Deer shortly behind. Coming up next, we have Adrian in a Fent 724 and Andrew in a Valtra T214. The Valtra supporting the John Deere weight block here at the moment. Flags are up. Coming up to the brow of the hill, the fans are just having the upper edge here. On the Valtra! Into them first. First bars, he's keeping he's keep some pace up there. Fair play to him. And she's really ripping in there. That's a good little run. Barrel down, though. Ah, oh, he let me down. He let me down. Fed not coming far behind here. 
Hey, it's a good run by the Valtry there, except for his barrel. Valtry just over the line first there, folks, and we did have a barrel down, so... It's a speed to make the final so far. It does, it does. We're going to go down, switch them across, switch sides. Track is really drying out there as well. So we got two more bulls after these uh, guys. One, two, eight, four. Uh, and then we're on to the big boys. Just lining up the Valtry and the fence here again. For their second go at it. I'm thinking the Valtra will just edge it this time again. If he can get a clean run. He said he is holding some pace in there. Come on, lad. Clean run, clean run. He's out of box one, he's clean. Ben just coming in box one there. Behave yourself in box two and you're away, lad. Here we go. Box two, clean, out. That's going to be a quick run. Hazard, he Hazard. Uh, yeah, that going to panel. That's going to be a quick run. That Bancho is going to do a quick run. Oh, complete the event on the way out there. Got a wee bit of tail swing on the zitter. Coming up next. It's like a 920. It's going to be a hard beat too. What's he up against, Kev? He's up against a Massey Ferguson 64.99 Massey Ferguson. So I think these two lads come in in the same little order. That's going to be a tight one. Especially if they're buddies, they're going to want them bragging rights. I think the flags are going up here, folks. This will be a good run. Two big brutes, they all starting off down the bottom. Plenty of wheel spin. Diff lock on. Keep her lit. These are neck and neck. Let's get out and have a look at this. Oh, we're coming up fairly tight there together at the halfway point. That Massey is doing more than I thought it would against this 7920. I think the Massey just has the edge here coming into the first bend. Some Nova for as well. Here we go, tinted windows by your racer tractor, black rims. What are you thinking of the Black Rims lad? Are you a Black Rims fan? Nah, I, uh, Oh! Has he got the wrong way? No! The rut's just caught him Look out. Look at this! <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, he's stalled! He stalled her! He stalled her! As if Black Tips he can see where he's going, hey! <laughs> oh, the 6 9 20 is true. It looks like a clean run. Yeah, clean run. This man is... He's going, he's going, he's going. <laughs> now, would, at this stage, would you finish the lap or would you just fill her an Oh, oh, oh a side, side break! Side break on that. He's going to take the barrels with him, I think. Man down, man down. Red flag. Yeah, I think he. He, he was going well! <laughs> He's just getting the fill of her, lad. He's just getting the fill of her. What have we up here now? We have the last two boys of this class. Who's the class? Desi Doherty. Desi Doherty. Man with good name. Our direction. Ah, I think class is a fair weapon now. How many horsepower is she? Ooh, I'm thinking. Jeez, she wasn't a lot over 200. We got over 200. What size for you? She's probably one of them jokes that boost, you know. The question is, is she boosting or is she not boosting? I think she is boosting. He's getting steered well under the corner. See, the windlock's doing some floating. It is. Yeah, that's the last lap there now. It is. That wasn't Desi's first day out. Oh, man down again. There we go. Barrel hit. Two oh. barrels hit. Ah, oh, sir. <laughs> Forgot my all of them Go wait. Go wait. Flag, Go hard. He's going to take that barrel home with him, I think. They ran flagged him there. Oh, she came out fairly squashed, Stewie. Uh, so the operators of class five, please start making your way down to the marquee. You will have to drive something. Better than Jimmy, I hope. Just for a moment of clarity, Kevin's away to the toilet. <laughs> I've gone far enough. Is it number one or number two? <laughs> I haven't decided yet. <laughs> what do we think of Kevin's blonde hair? Kevin used to be ginger. Oh, did he? Oh, oh, there. oh yes. If you watch Kevin in his early farm flex days, he was, he was a ginger. He's gone blonde. <laughs> We're lined up here now, John. You're 36 and 80 versus the Faltra. This is a semi, I think. The Massey's got her work cut out here to win this. But I'd like to And they're off. They're off with a bit of gusto too. There's a wee bit of a, a hollow down there where everybody's spin taking off now. It takes a wee bit of going. 
Falcon's going well, hey. Falcon's going well. Falcon's going well, picking up good speed up that hill. Still in front. Okay. Don't forget, guys, Sammy, this a single run, you gotta not yeah, touch barrels. They toss a coin, pick the track side. <laughs> Look at the laps of the chiller and the, the ruts. 36 is giving it all she got. The Valter has it. The Valter's through. Clean run. I think Valter went well there now. Right. The class has to win, Jimmy. I can't have a fit in the final. Why not? There's a fit bit in my 7 8 10. Somebody wasn't driving her right. It's just not as easy as it looks, you know. I know, Jimmy, I forgive you. I usually make everything look easy. I forgive easy. you, I forgive you. Fence gathered something speed up here. Desi's got his work cut out here, Jimmy. He's just not getting the getaway you were hoping for, was he? And he's in the back foot. And round the first box for the fence. Barrel down. It's game over for Desi. There's something falling in the ground up below Desi's tuner there. I don't know what's flying. Healthy for Desi. He broke something in that tuner. He nearly would have done it if he had to leave that barn standing. There's a right bit of muck starting to fly at them corners now. I don't know what a dirt bike out there now, Jimmy. You do some damage. If anybody happens to have a spare power, how about for Alan Clay now? I have a feeling that that left hand track has got a wee edge on it. So the Dara's got his work cut out for him here if he's going to take it. Yeah. But there's one track seems to be quicker up the street, the straight, the other one seems to come in a bit quicker near the end. He was quick off the mark there, wasn't he? Fast out of traps. This is our final, people. This is our final, last four. Pretty much neck and neck here at the minute now. It's going to be a tight finish. It is. I think the Valka is just making a right turn first. Into the first box. Oh, I think the Valter just has the smallest bit of age here at the moment. Valter's well, just going to take it, I think. Oh, out the gap, over the line. Tip the load, good. Ah, there you go. Maybe good enough to beat me, but he'll not beat the rest of the field. Mr. Valter took it. Andrew Kennedy. Everybody give Andrew Kennedy a round of applause. We'll get Andrew, we'll get him hooked off and get him up and get him his trophy. So if you if you've ever watched any of my vlogs where we do a wee bit of mechanic at the old deers, as you do, uh, Sloan Agri made our trophies for us out of parts that we gathered up randomly. So this is our turbo trophy. Oh well done Andre! Thank you. Not only did you win the class, you set the fastest lap. How does that feel? Very good, thank you. How do you find the conditions out there? Oh, good. good. No water in the ruts no in the water. corners? No, no. Keep it going. <laughs> well, uh, was it the magic John Deere Whitlock that gave oh, you the edge, I. lad? I was told last night if I won, I've got some flagging up with that. So <laughs> there you are. <laughs> are you not going to spray a grey or anything to match it in? I told him to not spray a grey, but it's just I like it the way it is. I like it the way it is. I'm just glad you bit that old fent a bit in my 7, 8, 10, lad. There you are. Happy then. I'd have to take that home now I've been driving myself, like. But. Take her away you this year. <laughs> Big round of applause for Andrew. I can assure you, ladies and gentlemen, it's no mean feat trying to drive around that course. Speaking from experience. Jimmy, Jimmy, I, I'm starting to feel like you're talking this up now. That man said it was easy. He said it was nothing. That man's just modest. There's not a modest bone in my body. <laughs> Here's this big brute of a dice below, lining up. Yes, yes. Look at the size of that monster! <laughs> well, looking down, looking at the size of them, I've been picking the dice. You never know, we could have a little pocket rocket up a Massey here, so you could just sneak it. Here we go, folks. Oh, good bit of black reek out of the roots there, just climbing the well. Oh, he set off the flying start. Away. These Masseys today are just sailing about the place. They're making a dent now. Quick tyres look impressive in the front of her like. What size are those? 
A massive's going well now. She just doesn't look as big compared to the big tower and dudes. I think the massive is going to do it here, lads. This is pretty neck and neck. The rips and the roars out of the tank. She is some size of it. On the return now, the massive's a fair bit smaller. He touched the center oh. line. He's going to take a barrel, I'd say. No, oh, he's after giving her power now. Look, he's out. The dice is going to do it. If he keeps her going. And out the door, out the gap. Massey touched the centre line. Massey did clip the centre line. There is a penalty there. And we found out that the Dutz is 265 horse. A bit big for what it is. I thought it'd be more. She looks like a monster. I was going to think like she's 300. Why not come and make the weekend out of it? Uh, last year we had so many people from down south, across in England, Scotland. I would advise to get hotels booked as soon as possible. Get those tickets booked for our event, then get straight on the hotel. Just come and enjoy it. As farmers, you know, we need a wee weekend off every now and again. And what perfect way, big weekend. Tickets on sale from Sunday the 3rd of March. That's when they kick off. And we will be closing them at the end of March, 31st of March. If you want a ticket, get it bought. Is there competition for how high we can throw the muck in the air, is there? Uh, I tell you what, you might win it then if there is. <laughs> tell you one thing, I'll, I'll be shutting the back with me anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so what's he boosting at here? So there's the gauge. Um, as you can see, it's reading the 60, but I never want to go there. Because I know what happens when you go there. Bang. Yes. No, we're trying to limit it to about 50. Now, I set it with a hill and nothing on behind me, so she might go past 50 once she starts with a good load on her, you oh, know. So yes. we'll, uh, we'll and will you ease off if she does? Have to, you know, I might have to drop her gear if she starts pushing past 50, like, you know, right. that's, that's scary territory. Uh, yes. And what has she done this year? She has mostly been getting tinkered with this year. <laughs> <laughs> The difference is, Jimmy, he didn't stop his leg reverse. The Massey is going to do it, I think. It's, uh, How long have you had Big Blue now? Uh, I, I couldn't believe it. I, I, I looked it up there. I think it's eight years. Wow. Yeah. Like a eye. Yeah. Tommy, boy. Tommy. Look at the muck, sir! Look at the muck! Look at the muck! Oh, coming up here with Alwyn Young's 8480. 7726 versus the 8480. And they're away. The 8480 sticking a bite and she's away. Alwyn going for the double here, is that correct? Doesn't seem to be much difference. Alwyn is going to be fighting for the double. I think the 8480 now has a wee increase on it. Pretty neck and neck. I think a bit of a green light kind of thing going on here on the right hand side. He's not running away with it. No, he's not. He's in first though. He's been around the track already. The only thing is now with the hard bits coming now, the maneuverability. 7726 isn't as big as the 8480. Oh! <laughs> and to be fair to him, hey, that whip dog hanging out front. He didn't touch the barrel on the way through box one. He's down through two. I say that box speed's pretty weak in there, Jimmy. Aye. There we go. Out to get out. Yes, clean her up for all of them. That's how it's done through the barrels, gentlemen. That is something special there, boys. That was a car of a dream. <laughs> that will be hard to beat, Jimmy. That's a, that was a final worthy run there. I think that is one to beat now. That's, that is a monster of a tractor there. Like. Zero balls down, zero balls down. Run two. Is all one going to hammer it around this side as easy as he hammered it around that one? I think he'll go, uh, he'll go a good way on um, doing the double here if he's able to slip through again. Now, if you were a real man, you would just go off and nailed it. That was good. I'll, I'll cruise this one. I'll take her easy. No, no, no. I just, I just know I'm not good then. This is called a competition. <laughs> <laughs> All one's away again. I think he's given a bit of ground even so far. I come to find them two tracks aren't a bad place to be. Climbing there. Starts to get a wee bit rubby and bumpy there now as you're starting to climb. Ah, there's, there's not much steering in it, you're just trying to get up the hill really. Yeah. 
pretty neck and neck coming in here to the first thing. Owen has a little bit on it. Just the slalom to go down. He is that tail swing judge to perfection. A bit of a tighter one this time. There's some lock in that massive. I love the way Owen can keep the speed through from box one to box two. Look at that, sir. Oh. <laughs> that gentleman is how it is done. I'm going to get all of them to give me lessons. Get a round of applause there, Jimmy, Alice. Jimmy, I think you should give me lessons too. <laughs> right, sir. Good luck and hammer them. Uh, Good luck. Thank you. I'll catch you in the other Yes, time. I'll catch you in the other <laughs> side. Tug well to her left, cook to her right. Whoa, about the door. Door. You're right, you can do this. Yes. Come on, the beans. I think that Cook might have a little bit of extra horsepower right enough compared to Tugwell. Correct. I seen the new turbo going in in a picture before this event. This is sort of like Cook's background stuff here. He does tractor pulling and all, so he's going to know what it is to be under this pressure. The smoke out of that. Is good. Box is clear. Action, action. Flags up. Here we go. Look at the reek out of that. There is so oh no how it is. <laughs> Dude, he's trying to jump off the stage here. <laughs> if that race doesn't sell on the pole for next year, nothing else will. Unbelievable. Oh. That is fierce. Has he got the skills to go around the barrels though to match it? He's out of box one, Clint. Oh, wrong gear. He's leaving himself tight for box two. He was up against one more horsepower there. I want to hear that again, Jimmy. I'm looking forward to run too. <laughs> Even Tugwell sounded good there too. So How many gallons of diesel do you think were through there? <laughs> I hope they came off all tankers are going to rain. Shower rain in just to upset the finals? Uh, I think no, I think that shower is going to blow over very quick. Get all these strange smells coming through here. <laughs> Right, getting ready for run two here. Forget about the other ball or not? Action, action. The only way I forget about that dinner is somebody's going to give me I driving don't. lessons. <laughs> We're away again. Fuck with things to go, I would have shook again if you just need to ruin him. Ah, oh, yeah, he just got to dog his way to the top of the hill. I think he could get him on the barrels. No, he's trying to. Oh, he's getting some run up the hill this time. Spinning her gears, boys. Spinning her gears. Did that thing start to spit out ash? <laughs> That's the way you like to smoke there, Jimmy. Sight to behold. That was unreal. Did you notice the way the three of us stopped talking there? <laughs> There's some note out of them two tractors. <laughs> Just jaw hanging open. Go. Just... <laughs> some buzz. Oh, uh, what a buzz. <laughs> that is phenomenal. I had to split the side brakes and ammo out. Wow. Yeah.
going through to the semis is Alwyn Young, 8480. Alistair Cook and Kenny Hegarty in the Massey 7726. And Kenny again, 7726. So, so three Masseys and a Ford in the final. I think that Ford is going to be hard beat. But I'm going to call it right now, I think Alwyn has it. You think? I think this is going to have to come down to driver here, is it not? Two exact same trackers. Two brothers of Hegarty's up here. This is wonderful. Do they live in the same household, though? I'm not sure. I think they're connected to a tractor dealership, so... That's... I'm guessing Massey. I'm guessing Massey, correct. <laughs> These were a last minute book in. I can't remember what they had booked in, but... They were swapped out for whatever was in the yard kind of thing. The rest of it was all sold. It must be good, Jimmy. Up, side by side. Front weight and one, is there? There is. Two brothers. Go on with the weight block, just getting that little edge coming up for the first bend. Bounce around that right now. Right, right? And right into the second box. Oh, oh, they're a bit of oh, there. Oh, oh, fire down. Oh. <laughs> red flag, red flag. He drove up on the barrel on this side and the right. Did you see that, low? Oh, oh dear. Both of them had bad runs. Too, too uh, aggressive against each other. Back to 103, over the line first. One so, ball down, one ball down. What would you call that? Is that who, who qualifies for the final from that run? Is this barrel removals of the finest here, is it? Hey. 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 Give that man a cheer! Woo! Lift it over your head! I'm straight night lad, it'll be grand. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> You'd never have to do that without around the course, would it not? Mind that it seems to me. That is not where I see that song going. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is not the final, this is the semi final. But for me, this is the final. These are the two trackers you want to see. The two fastest, the two best operators. So, let's see who has it. Both big in, both of them are big into the tractor pulling. So, action, action. Flags are down and away we go. Better has to see who wins the whole time here. The knee haul was slow at the start, but she's picking up the speed. He was so fast up that lane, all of us in the last time, but he's he's giving it all he's got. <laughs> he hasn't, he hasn't. He's beat him in the health line. Oh, he's fighting oh, the side break. He's, he's going for it, he's going for it. Oh, it's tight. Round to go under the second box for more or less neck and neck. This is the tightest race we've seen today. Go on! Oh! Oh, we got him! Oh, we got him! Alistair had a barrel all the way out. Alistair had the barrel. On the right -hand side. That barrel could have knocked him out. Boys, who won that? Yeah. The anticipation is hey, killing hey, me. Hey, hey. All one, we think. All one. We yeah, think. yeah, yeah, yeah. See. There you go, bro. We got all one back uh, into the all final. The winner, then. <laughs> that, that was some show there. That was, that was some pole. Listen, that was my final. That's what I wanted to see. Fair play. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming today. Can I just say once again, it's been a pleasure having you. We didn't think today it would happen with the, as well as it did with the rain we had this morning. It is, it's been a pleasant enough day, thankfully. Ground conditions just about kept together, made it happen. Thanks again to Red Rock for the chillers. Thanks again to Moor Concrete for the safety barriers. That was lethal, Owen. 
Well, I will say I can't wait to see it from the drone when you hit that top gun right now in barrels. That was that was something special, unreal. Right, Thanks. big big ones now. Wow, well, so whatever. What? Whatever. Flags are up. Action, action. Flags are down. We're off. Oh, we've got a good out start there. Climbing a bit more rapidly than he was the last time. On the same side as he was the last time as well. 7726 hasn't been badly left behind. It looks like all one has it at the minute. Got that one. A clean run for Alwyn. Alwyn versus the line, zero five Jimmy, zero I'm going to make you pick up this big heavy trophy for him. That's a two man lift. Double trophy for Alwyn Young today. He has redeemed himself well. Ernie, you've been spectating, you've been participating. What have you enjoyed about today? Oh, it was a good day's crack. I really enjoyed it. It was tight going, getting up out of the muck. Uh, it's something different, you know. Was, we're, I'm used to tractor pulling and I know the insides and outs of it, but. You have to be thinking all the time. My, my tractor's been parked up four years. Wow. And uh, we've took in and done her up. We had to put a uh, new clutch. There's six clutch packs in it. Uh -huh. And uh, there's new pumps in her. And the engine still needs a bit of work, but I wanted to get her out for the day, you know. Yes. So she's down a wee bit in power, you know. So I'm going to do the engine up there. Anyone that didn't make the trip out to today, what did they miss out on? That, that last pull there put on. That. How amazing was that? Unbelievable. I'm just looking forward the next time round now, Alvin and Big Blue are a threat they're pulling out because he, he, he did leave him there at one point. Like. Oh, listen, he, he got about a third of the way up and then yeah. his power or the boost must have kicked in yeah. and he, he yeah. left all one there. Yeah, he, just, he did leave him. Like, yeah. Yeah. The, the 8480 for the big threat there, she is, she's very nimble. Yeah, the 8480 at the threat they're pulling is the yoke to bait. Like, she is. The yeah. daughter of them. Yeah. Congratulations. No worries, John. Thank you. Oh, and I thought you had it in the bag of walking the park. No. Oh, Sir Cook not. came out of the back there <laughs> and decided to give her the gun. Uh, what did you make of him whenever he was head to head you in in front of you on the stage? To be honest, uh, I, I could have swore Alistair had it here, even without doing the pull. Uh, I know what Alistair had done, he put on, he got more power, a good bit more power. <laughs> they, um, no, it probably was going around the course, I'd say. Your first run, I thought you flew around the barrels. That was yeah. pristine driving. That's it. Look, it's only, it's only length for me. I well, was, I was coming back and I was set of it on, and it's only length. I'm looking forward to that rematch next year. Many horsepower is on her, all one. 315. I think good cooks are around the same, and these are around 315, 300. I do know where I can get a chip for. <laughs> <laughs> yes, thanks very much. Really appreciate it. Really yes, appreciate it. Much. And I'll see you next great year. Day. Hopefully, yes. 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 What was the best? What was the best? So you can give me an interview. Yeah. What other event can you go to to get that kick from what those boys have just done there? None. None. What was your favorite? What was your favorite pull? Big Blue and Owen Young. Owen Young. And oh my goodness! Yeah. That should have been the final though. Yeah. yeah. I was yeah. screaming. <laughs> yeah. Don't not the semis, not yeah, the yeah, semis yeah, finals. Yeah. That's a yeah. that's a that's the one everyone wanted to see. Yes. You know yeah. that was it. You could have just left, drove out the gate, and that's you done. You know, but uh, so it's all next year. Next year, hopefully they'll be in the final. Two very big tractors and we track. Anyone out there that missed it, that didn't get a chance to come and see it, what do you say there? Book your tickets early. There you go. Book your tickets early. <laughs> Thanks very much. The job that you've done today, Jimmy, was sublime. You did not stop talking on that stage from this morning till about five minutes ago. So I appreciate what you've done. You're a master at what you do, and honestly, it was it was it was a pleasure to have you. But give me give me this. What was your best pull? I thoroughly enjoyed the first run on the heats that Alwyn had. Yes. I thought it was a cracker, and Cook and his first run was not going well. No. But for some reason, whenever he was again all one, yeah. there was another gear up oh, in there. there I think the boost uh, on the boost gauge, she went up to 60. <laughs> and he said, I can't let her go to 60. I guarantee she was at 60. Because she found power halfway up that track. Oh, she was for going. I'll tell you, two fast tracks. Mm -hmm. 
Totally. I thought, no, these things are not. Yeah. I've all I've ever known as a fast track is not a grip and tractor. Yes. But for some reason, them two fast tracks gripped serious well today. And oh. they got on around the slalom, all right. And after doing it myself, I realised it's not that easy. Uh, so, so talk me through your talk me through your go at it like. I got going. I couldn't get going in D. D was too high, so I had to get going in C. So then I had the gear changed to contend way. But because of the pull on her, you had to get her down the auto quads as well, because yes. automatic going down was not going to work, wasn't going to cut it. So then I got the straight delt way, and then I got myself flung into the corner, and the front just was not going round. And then I got myself into a tizzy, and when I'm used to that happening, I just go to the side brake. As soon as I done that, she anchored herself. And then I made that big show of myself, and there was no coming back from it. Yes. So that, I just heard the crowd, because I seen you going off, and I was in an interview, and then I heard the crowd go, yeah! And I looked up, and I went, what's Jimmy done like, you know? Uh, but no, no, fair play. And for me, a standout one would have been that two-wheel drive Massey. Oh, aye, because that was that early get, in the day. Where did aye. he get the grip from? Oh. And the power? I know, I know. He was flying like. Last year, I went from a busted engine to that there. This year, like that was epic. You look at the first event, Jimmy, to this event, how different was it? I see, we're going back a few years now. My memory's not quite what yeah. it was. But now, as I say, the people this time, there was a lot more people that had a, and that sat through rain at the start of the morning, like, and they were quite happy. They all sat and they, they were smiling and grinning to the end. Yeah. And they were a very workable crowd. It was good to see so many folk. Ah, it's unbelievable. Unbelievable. Jimmy, we want you back. It was <laughs> on, honestly, your commentating on it, your crack up there was absolutely 90. We appreciate it. Thanks for coming and we'll see you next year. I'm getting a wee bit better every year. <laughs> <laughs> so Kevin, all day you were on the stage. Yeah. You weren't supposed to be there all day. No, that's no, but we, a, we, we stood in. <laughs> you had a big job. You'd done an absolutely outstanding job. We're super happy. I mean, you, honestly, you couldn't have asked you and Jimmy Duck better. The crack was 90. You just knew, you know, the, the feed that was coming through, you kept the crowd entertained. So we really appreciate it. For you, what was the best pool? So it was Alwyn and, and Big Blue at the Why end, was right? that not the final? That's what I want to ask. Because we were afraid one of them wouldn't make the final. <laughs> and if one of them didn't make the final, then we were never going to have that pull. Yo, if we no. split them. How if we split them. Why would they not make a final? I was radio through. That's got to be the imagine, final. Imagine if I was standing here and you were like, why did you let Alwyn go against that in the, no, in the semi? I was screaming down. I was screaming down this going, Owen and Big Blue in the final. That had, that had to be the final. I, I but do you know what though? You wouldn't make it. Well, do you know? See, see, looking back on it now, I know what next year's final is going to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unless someone comes out of the woodwork somewhere, you know. But those two, Son. that that was. If that doesn't get you going clean mad, yeah, nothing will. Jimmy, Jimmy Doc said a good fight. He was like, you know, that was a good one because the whole place was silent. You could yeah. hear a pinch up. No one was talking. The mics were just here. We were like. Yeah, that was <laughs> lethal. And uh, you're watching them and it's the concentration in all when young. Like he has a crack now. White knuckles. Was, I know. Yeah. <laughs> he was like, he was just gunning for it. Like, you know. But you so, see, when he comes yeah. into the fence, he'd come up like this. Then when he comes to the fence, he just kind of goes like this. Yes. Because <laughs> 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 he knows you're swinging. Like, yes, amazing, amazing. Johnny wow. Neal's first pull was brilliant. He gave me a bit of stick about his second pull, said he didn't touch a barrel. So. Yeah. I radioed through and they said he did touch a barrel, so it'll be interesting to see what the uh, what the footage plays Scotch back like. VAR yes, there. yes, yes. I actually said to me, play it back. I said, Johnny, I don't have VAR. You know what I mean? So, but uh, I'm interested to see that. What a uh, day! No. What an event! Unreal! And even like everyone, like from putting weights on trailers to the lads filming to the people doing the tickets to the people parking the cars, like serious. Everyone just pulled together something unreal. Aaron, all everyone that came, it was just it was amazing. Yeah, yeah. It was class. It was unreal. 2024, watch yep. this space. See you there. I'm not sure where it started. You're turning on me like the enemy. I'm the Never been fragile. But you always come through, yeah, they ricochet. Oh, 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 oh,